you know, replacements. Yeah, it's probably not the best car, the one you chose, but the fact you haven't taken care of it is the real reason why it's a piece of crap. Yeah, but there are inherent flaws. <laughs> there are inherent flaws within a, within a manufacturer's specific motor or Amen. transmission. Like the one called the one. <laughs> Ford, <Stop>. Outer Stroke, <laughs> 6.0. Come I can, on, those, I can't would, defend those it. would launch all the time. I cannot defend that, but I still am a Ford guy. Can you weld an engine block, a cast iron engine block? No, I can't. Is it possible? It is possible. I can't do it, but I mean, obviously. Do you think it's possible to weld in a block? I do, I do think it is definitely possible. I don't know if it's worth it because if you do all that work and then the weld somehow goes wrong, then you're taking the whole engine out again. So for me, cylinder heads maybe because yeah. it doesn't take that much. But if the block comes undone and you're taking the whole block out of the truck, that's a lot of work. Six zero, six four, or six seven. Which one would you pick? <laughs> I'm a Ford guy. I wouldn't do it. I would go with the Cummins right. engine. I would go with the Cummins. I would go with the Cummins. I, I, I guess because... Okay, if it was the last girl on earth, right. the 6 the 6 the 6 I think I take the 6 Really? I think I take the 6 It's easier to work on. It's easier to work on. And, and because I'm a little bit older, I like the Huey style. Like, I like... And most people probably say, oh, that's completely wrong. I like because I really understand high pressure oil, you know, like high pressure oil to drive injectors. And because we understand everything about them, if we had a truck that had one in it and something went wrong, we could fix it like that. Versus we haven't seen a lot of six sevens because a lot of them are still under warranty. They warranted the crap out of those motors. We haven't seen a bunch of them. Um, we did have a couple six fours in here. We had one six four that came in here and um, it had uh, main bearing failures. Not not rod the six seven, and then there was another six four that we had that came in here before that had. Uh, well, sorry for interrupting again. I've heard that is because the injector for the regeneration process is dumping fuel into the into the oil pan and creating oil. Right. So it's oil and diesel fuel mixed together, which is wiping out the bearings. Well, that that is one of the issues. But I mean, no different than you know the the old the, the older Duramaxes. I mean, you know, you have an injector that would just start filling up the crankcase full. Of, you know what I mean? It would come out the top of the injector, especially the injector had a crack above the seal, and it just fill up the you know the the head and drain down in there. And so, kind of be the same the same kind of thing. Uh, I, I can't pick an engine. I, like I said, I just see, I don't know what all the problems are going to, I guess, you know why I'd buy the 6L? Why I'd want the 6L? I know everything that could go wrong with it. <laughs>